Time's up, check your clock, you've been ticking too long You might have hit the spot, but you've hit it too long Let me give it to you loud and clear Sorry. Let me give it to you loud and clear Sorry. Good everybody, it's day three at SunTrust Park. We're super early for the David Justice autograph signing. We'll show you some footage when we get inside.
My first at bat, I'm on my knee and on that circle, grab the grip his head. I remember what Fred did. I remember being on my knee. And you know, now I'm at 23 days, right? And I hear the blues, right? So then I'm on one knee and I, and I say, God, you don't put me in a lot of tough situations. <laughs> Dave Justice signing got a major W. Knocked out like nine items for me. It was the highlight of the day. Uh, hopefully, we can do better at, at the game than we did last night's game. But if not, we scored a lot of Dave Justice autographs for the day. All right, heading with my buddies over to go eat at Hooters. We'll see y'all there. I've been here at Hooters, just left the Dave Justice signing, about to get something to eat, and head back over to the stadium for the game tonight. left the Mizuno store from the Brian Jordan signing and we'll try to catch some of the alumni as they arrive to get their autographs before they get in the stadium.
Left the stadium, the game's still going on. We'll see what players we can catch leaving early. See if we can increase our autograph numbers for the day. Been uh, a better day quality wise, done about the same amount of quantity as yesterday. But maybe we can increase the uh, quantity here when the alumni exit out of the ballpark. We'll be back. Alright y'all, that's a wrap for Alumni Weekend. I'll show you what I got when we get back to the house. Got Jose Alvarez twice, Mike Balecki, Ryan Klusko, Jay Howe, Marcus Giles twice, Pete Smith. I killed it on Dave Justice. Knocked out seven cards for me. Plus he signed a ball for me with his Rookie of the Year inscription. Got lucky and was able to get John Smoltz when he was leaving. Got Braves Hall of Famer and legend Ralph Gar. This is probably my most interesting story. I got the Braves legendary usher, Walter Banks, who's been an usher for the Atlanta Braves since they first moved to Atlanta at all three of their stadiums. Had him sign this and he voluntarily put a Hall of Fame inscription. Then, unexpectedly, then he tells me he has something for me. Then he pulls this out of his pocket, already pre-signed. I thought that was like the coolest thing ever. <laughs> like, you can just tell it made his day that we asked him for his autograph. Then last but not least, we got Brian Jordan. He didn't only play for the Atlanta Braves, but he also played in the NFL for the Atlanta Falcons. We got him at a Mizuno free autograph signing before the game today. So, today was way better than day one. Day one sucked compared to how it used to be done at Turner Field. Today made up for the lack of quantity and quality of autographs that we got yesterday. But uh, today was a very good day. That's my Braves Alumni 2017 weekend adventure. Please give a big thumbs up if you like the video. Subscribe. And stay tuned for more videos like this, along with other shoe unboxings and mall vlogs, etc. Until next time, it's your boy Infamous C, the ATL Don, signing out. Peace.